Today on the Beam channel, I want to talk about validating your code with Dialyzer. First of all, I want to tell you if you are trying to get started with code with Elixir in your company, please give me a shout. I do training courses, both introduction to Elixir and more advanced Elixir courses. You can only link or my phone number down below. As you're getting started in Elixir, you want to find different ways of validating your code. You'd like to know that your code is correct for however we define that. So one tool you should definitely use is Dialyzer. Dialyzer is a tool which is written by Costas Sagonis and his team at Uppsala for use with Erlang and also works with Elixir and presumably LFE. And it finds discrepancies in Erlang and Elixir code. So if you're returning a value that can never match what you said the assertion is, or any of a hundred other things where the code just does not match. And also the specs, if you add a spec to your function and it says one thing and the code says another, then Dialyzer will find it for you. It's also good if you refactor some code and make some changes, you know, you maybe add another parameter to a function and suddenly you're calling a function that no longer exists, it'll find it for you. It's a wonderful tool. You do want to use it from when you start a project and the way you use it in Elixir is you use the Dialixir package. Dialixir is a add-on to mix and you just add it into your mix config file and then do a mix depths get depths compile and then you type mix Dialixir and it'll print out a bunch of warnings. In general you'd like to start this when you start your project because if you start it later it's going to give you a lot of warnings that you're going to have to deal with. So start it early. And there's also, you can look at the docs, it'll show you how. You can say, yes, I know about these set of warnings and I'm going to ignore them for now and fix them later. That's a way to do that. And it will then tell you all sorts of things about your code that you, know, you might not have known otherwise and are problems. It is a wonderful tool. It is almost never wrong. The messages are somewhat cryptic sometimes, but it will definitely help you get code that is really top notch in your project, and that's useful. When you start up Dialyzer for the first time, it'll create what's called a PLT, a substantial persistent lookup table. And basically it has to analyze all of the libraries and all the standard lib and all that stuff, as well as your code. Now, you used to have to do this by hand and add all the files manually. Nowadays, Mix, or if you're using Erlang Rebar 3, will do that automatically. So the first time you create a PLT file, it'll take a couple minutes, but then it'll go really fast, because basically it does that analysis once, it sticks it in a file in your project somewhere and you just ignore it. So that is the short idea of what Dialyzer does. You should definitely look into it and you should definitely use it. It will definitely help you um, in terms of how to get your code correct and smoothly to production. And if that was helpful to you, please like and subscribe this video and uh, Please feel free to reach out with suggestions and comments. I, try, I love hearing from you all.